Hey everyone, welcome back to another video on this channel. My name's Saga and I'm a software engineer in London. And in this video, I'm going to basically show you what my desk setup looks like for when I'm working for the company I work at and also when I'm doing my own personal project and stuff like that. So the first thing I want to point out is that I do have a standing desk. Um, it's not an electrical one. It has a hand crank. So over here, if I open this out, basically have to swirl this bad boy around either way if you want the, the desk to go up or down. So the desk itself is actually from Ikea. Um, I don't think they sell it anymore because when I was looking to get the desk itself, um, they said it's sort of like at the end of its life. So um, I don't know if you'll be able to buy a similar sort of hand cranked one from Ikea in like from now on. So right now my desk is sort of configured to work on my own personal projects. Um, so I have my two screens here that are all connected to my uh, custom built PC, which is over here. And I'll put the specs of my PC on the screen right now. So the two screens I have here are 24 inch Dell um, ultra thin bezel monitors. Um, I got these in 20, 15 I think it is um, good because that's when I got my two screens and made my custom PC also my keyboard I don't really use a fancy keyboard I just have this really basic Logitech keyboard that I also bought when I bought my screens and made my PC and it's lasted me ever since I've never had to really change it um, but also again I think this keyboard is no longer being sold because Logitech don't make this type of keyboard anymore. For my mouse I do use a Corsair Harpoon and um, this is the second one I bought after my first one sort of stopped working. Um, I say it's really cheap, well it's really cheap, it's like £20-ish, yeah so it's a cheap mouse and also it is um, super cool and also if you're a gamer I also recommend as well. Okay so that's basically the tour of my desk when I'm not actually working for the company that I'm working at. It's This is just my setup when, say, I want to work on my own projects or when I'm working on my YouTube video stuff or also when I just want to relax and maybe play some games from now time to time. So now I'm going to switch my setup so it's basically looking like what I work with when I'm at work itself. So there we have it, this is the transformed setup. So now I basically use uh, my work laptop to do all my work from pretty much. I don't need to use my uh, main PC at the bottom. I do currently only use only one of my two big screens because mainly I don't have any cable that you can uh, use. Where's it gone? There's two USB C ports, uh, but I don't have any cables that are USB C to HDMI. I only have one. HDMI to HDMI cable, so that's all I'm able to do when I'm connecting um, my big screen to my laptop. Um, the, the good thing is because I'm using HDMI with my laptop, I use display ports with my main PC, so I don't have to actually manually take cables in and out, I just have to change the source of the, the display. This is my um, Anchor USB hub, which is super useful, especially since I'm switching stuff between my two um, PCs, so my what my work laptop and then my main PC. So all I have to do is just unplug this one cable, and then my my headset, my headset charging cable, my uh, mouse, and my keyboard can then just be used from one computer to another. So I don't have to plug four different wires into one computer or the other. I just move one USB cable, and then the whole thing's just switch pretty much so it makes it super easy to do that. I also have my um, Corsair gaming headset thing which I use both for work and when I'm just doing other stuff at home um, because it's super cool in the sense where the audio quality is great um, and the mic is also pretty pretty easy to use. I mean the good thing is it also has like a, a mute button on here so you don't have to press mute on your computer or anything you can just mute your mic from there and you can even detach your mic if um, 
you don't need to use your mic so it doesn't come in your in your face maybe say if you're eating or if you're you just don't want a massive boom mic sticking out in front of you so you have that option as well. Um, this light also is a super cool thing to have. It is um, an Elgato key light um, and I use it because a lot of my meetings at work have to be done via video call. That's why I have this other webcam as well. So it's just super nice so you don't just look like, I don't know, a black silhouette um, <laughs> on, on camera. So that's uh, in essence why I have this light. I also use this light when I'm videoing my YouTube videos, so that's another use for it as well. Last two things I wanna mention that I do have in my desk setup, I suppose, is my water bottle. It's super important just to have water there with you because you know what, you need hydrating because you know that's just how humans are. And the final thing is this aeroplane because yes, I studied aerospace engineering and I do like, you know, things that fly, so I got a little A380 here that my friend gave me um, after he did his internship at Airbus a couple of summers ago. Uh, not summers, but a couple of years ago. So there we have it. That is my desk tour, basically showing you how I work at work and also how I do things outside of work. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. And if you have any questions about what I have here and also maybe what I do at work, then uh, drop a comment below. Um, yeah, I'm happy to answer your questions. So. See you in another video but also if you do want to check out you know how i got into working at accenture as you could probably tell by the logo on my uh, wallpapers um, do check out this other video where i show you like the whole recruitment process for the company see you in another one guys